The Akira firmware contains adjustable independent filters for the pan, roll, and tilt axis. The purpose of the filters is to eliminate noise, allowing you to achieve the highest possible stiffness. In addition, we have added noise level indicators for each axis to aid in the tuning process. The auto-tune procedure remains the same. Before tuning, make sure that your camera is rigidly mounted, the Movi is balanced, and that all the clamps are tight. If anything is left loose, it can reduce the maximum stiffness values or cause oscillations. Start by tuning the pan axis. You will find that holding the hand grip while tuning the pan axis will allow you to achieve higher pan stiffness. To begin tuning, increase the stiffness value until you find the sensitive spot where an oscillation can easily be triggered by pushing the Movi. Then go into the filter adjustment. Try different filter values to find the sweet spot where there is no oscillation. Filter values that are too low can produce high frequency oscillations, while values that are too high can produce a low amplitude oscillation. Once you have achieved the best filter settings, go back and decrease the stiffness value around 5% as a safety margin. If it is not possible to filter out the oscillation, then the stiffness values are too high. Once you have tuned the pan, roll, and tilt axis, grab the Movi and put it into different realistic shooting positions. Do this while observing the noise level indicators. It is important to tune the Movi for each Movi method. For example, you may experience different tuning values when operating on a jib or an Analta. For more tutorials, visit freeflysystems.com. And thanks for watching.